Yeah, it's fine. This guy has to go. Without any further ado, this is my Honda S2000. Now I decided to go with the Suzuka blue exterior, um, again, carried over to the blue interior. I really like this color combination. Um, I think it sets the car off really nicely. Um, now that doesn't mean that I'm not gonna wrap the car later on in the future, but um, as far as it sits right now, it's completely stock. It's 100% completely stock. Uh, there's literally nothing that's been modified on this car. I mean, it, it is a 05 AP2 with, uh, I bought it with 28,000 miles on it. And uh, it's, it's, been, it's been awesome so far. But uh, the first round of mods is gonna include things like exhaust, uh, upgrade the brakes, so we do pads, fluid, stainless steel lines, that kind of stuff. And because in March, we have our first track day with this car. So we're really, I'm really, really excited. I hope you guys are too. And I'm gonna show you guys around the car. I'm gonna show you guys everything uh, pretty much about the car. And I packed extra GoPro batteries so that my camera wouldn't die. Exception right now. <laughs> huh? oh, okay. mm. Now, now you see there, boys. This is good, and that's good, but that 12 valve Cummins, that's better than all. <laughs> VTEC, 
I don't know if you guys can really hear that on the GoPro, but if you can, then, I, I, oh man, if you can, the sound of VTEC is just incredible. The steering is really nice too. The feel you have to get used to if you haven't driven an S2000 before. But, even if you haven't driven an S2000 before, you'll acclimate to the steering pretty quickly if you've driven other sports cars. It's not terribly, uh, it's not, it's not like it, like it doesn't have any feel. Um, it could have a bit more, but again, like I said, it's, it's something you'll get used to. Um, it doesn't have quite as much feel as say a Miata, I have to say, but it's a, it's more direct than the steering in a Miata. So you kind of trade off a little bit, just a little bit of steering feel for how direct the steering is. This has more direct steering than a Miata for sure. Um, and I, and I've driven the NC Miata, the ND Miata, and this doesn't have, it's got a little bit less steering feel, but the steering, but the actual, um, the ratio of the steering, how quick it gets from lock to lock is definitely quicker and it's more direct. So that's a trade I'm willing to make. Park in what? Some way, but we'll just get uh, just some generic like side stop. Okay. Park in like a cool looking way. Not like to park normally, but park in like a cool way. We'll just walk around with like a slow walk. Oh! So we're up at this, uh, we're up at this overlook now, kind of an overlook sort of parking lot. And um, we were just, I'm with Jeep guy, and we were just talking about how you look at the S2000, the wheels on the S2000, and they're 17s, you know, they're not huge, but they do a really good job of filling up the fender wells, right? And no. then you come, <laughs> then, you, then you no. come over here, Stop. then you come over here to, to the ends, to the NC Stop. Miata with like twice as much room as my shoe. Look, okay. look, it's like, it's huge. It's a monster truck. Look at the, the the back is even bigger. It's a monster truck. Sorry. It's just big frame. It's what? It's just big frame. Uh, jokes on you. It doesn't have one. Oh, you got <laughs> And this is how you finish a good drive. Yep. This is how you finish a good drive. Right, got a, yes, exactly. No, we've got a gorgeous oh, lake even got an right here. Shoes. What? Oh God. Now we've got a gorgeous lake right here. Two Roadsters, S2000, NC Miata. I know a lot of the Miata guys are gonna go, eh, it's an NC, but. It's not mine. But the NCs are actually, they're not actually that bad. I've driven, I've driven a few of them. Wait. And what? Wait, there's a speed limit for this area right here. Is it five? Or is that the lake speed limit? Ah. Uh, so that's pretty sad. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to click the like button. Tell us in the comment section below what you guys thought of it. I love the S2000. I am I am super in love with this car and I've got big plans for it. Um, uh, and I hope you guys are as excited for those plans as I am. It's actually already signed up for four different track days this year. And uh, it will be It'll be out on the track first in March, and I'll give you guys more info on that as it gets closer, and all of that will be filmed, all of it. Like, all of it, all of it, all of it will be filmed. But if you guys wanna see any new videos at all with the S2000, and you wanna see the build process on the S2000, don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Talk to you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed.